Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. I don't know how long this one's gonna go on for. It'll be just today, it might be a few days, I don't know. Um, but I thought I would just, to be honest, it's giving me something to do in the day to actually like be able to film and edit, which is nice. Um, although I was gonna start filming fashion content again and if you guys saw in the last vlog, I picked off all my nails. Look at the state of them, that's such a horrible color. <laughs> um, I picked off all of my gel extension tip things and then went to bed and must have had an itchy face and sharp fingernails and scratched the shit out of my face. Um, so that's great. Also, this is like my good side. So when I take pictures, I always have this side <laughs> in the camera and now, yeah, I look crazy. So that's very annoying, gotta let that heal. But I just got a few parcels come in the mail, so I thought I would go through them with you. I'm just putting some earrings in, these are so cute. Um, they are from, and other stories, let me show you them. They're just little hoops, but they have like this kind of detailing in the middle. So I'm wearing them, also I got dressed today for the first time in about 10 days. I haven't worn joggies, so it feels nice to actually be rest. Um, so yeah, as I say, I got some parcels. I'm gonna open them with you and then I don't really know what today's going to entail. I mean, I literally have like no work to do really and I just got dressed um, for not really any reason other than trying to feel good. Hello, darling. Ah. Do you wanna come say hi? Say hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. They can't see you down there. There you go. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I am going to show you my outfit because I love this dress. I think it was like 30 pounds as well, which is so crazy. I think it looks so expensive. Like if this was in, where? Even like Zara, I reckon this would be about 60 to 80 pounds. But it was like 30 from Topshop. Yeah, so it got really, really nice puff sleeves and like a big long cuff, which I love. Um, it's kind of high neck and it does tie at the back has a little thin belt here and yeah I think it's just very very cute I also think this would look absolutely stunning with heels um for like a wedding and things like that look at my face <laughs> uh, I'm going to go and grab some scissors and then I'll open these parcels with you okay so the first thing is from the eyelash emporium which is PR so they said we wanted to send you some goodies whilst you might not be able to get to your beauty appointments and it's their after after care range available at Superdrug, and it's currently on save one three. I don't know what that means. I think there's a deal on, which is actually a really lovely thing to receive because I have no lashes on at the minute, and I picked every single one of them off literally. So I feel like my eyelashes need some TLC. So we have. Lengthen and nourish for use with eyelash extensions and natural lashes. So that'll be a serum. Um, oh, is it? No, that's a mascara. This is a serum. And then, oh, extension remover. That would have been so good to have the other day. And then some little under eye pads. So that's so nice. Thank you. Another bit of PR from Pixie. They do the most. Actually, Pixie. I would. I'll explain this another day when I'm when I'm able to show you my skincare routine but I started using a whole routine from them um, before I went for my facial and it is so good I used the whole milky like routine so I think it was like a seven or six step routine and my skin looked so so nice um so yeah I really am enjoying their products at the minute it's just a little kind of like set um so glycolic acid toners and oh i think it's all three are the same yeah glow tonic toner so i will never run out look how big that is um and this has my name on it very cute pixie always do the most gorgeous um pr packages so thank you then i think this is my slippers that i ordered so in my last vlog i showed you my emu ones that bean had annihilated so i ordered a new pair i've already had the gray pair and the pink pair and they do last, like I'm not having to buy new pairs all the time because they're not lasting. It's because um, Bean eats them and wrecks them. 
so I just picked up a black pair this time. I absolutely love these slippers. They are like the best in the world. Like they're like this. So you can get your toes out so you don't get too hot, but they're just super comfortable and really lovely and fluffy. So got them. Um, if you're gonna buy these, I'll leave them down below. I highly, highly recommend them, but you have to size up in them. So I'm a UK three and I have to get a UK five in these because they're absolutely huge. I mean, tiny. So size up at least two sizes. And then this is a dress from Topshop that I ordered, I think. Yeah, I ordered this yesterday when I was doing huh, some stories for you guys on Instagram. I was trying to find like nice, like this kind of thing to wear at home um, that isn't joggies but is comfortable. So I saw this dress and I had to get it. I thought it was so cute. So it's just a midi dress with buttons and then it's got a nice kind of like dropped three tier hem. It's a very bad job of showing you it, but you can kind of see there. And then it has this really nice, oh, it's like very, it's kind of like a leopard print, but it's not like garish, you know? So I thought that would be really cool, especially with trainers and leather jackets in spring, summer. Not that we can leave the house right now, but you know, wishful thinking. Um, okay, so that's all that I got today. Um, I don't really know what the plan is today. So anything that excite, anything, if anything exciting happens, I will show you. Good morning. So I haven't spoke to you guys in a few days. Um, but this morning I was just shooting some content for Instagram, which I'm finding really difficult because I'm not the kind of person that shoots inside and like does really nice pictures. I'm very much an outside person, but we'll go on with it. Um, and then this morning all my bits to do my nails arrived. So I've just taken off this nail varnish I put on. Um, I hope this works out. I saw someone do it on Instagram last night and it worked out fine. So <laughs> we'll see. This is what I ordered though. So because I've picked off all of my nails, um, I don't actually need like half of it, which is a bit annoying, but I guess it'll help. Um, it'll come in handy when I'm putting on a new set. So acetone, I got these little tools which you like scrape off the gel with when you've used the acetone. Um, I got cotton balls and these like that you put the cotton in with the acetone and let your nails soak in them which I don't need any of that so that's a bit annoying and then to do my actual nails I got powder on my nose which is the colour I always used to wear before I had my extensions on I got these little wipey things which are the things that dehydrate your nail and also wipe away the sticky stuff at the end I got loads and loads of buffers because these were the only amount of ones I could get on Prime nail files like the proper heavy duty ones top base top and wait top coat and base coat why is this focus being funny there i don't know what this brand is i don't really know what ones to get they didn't have any shellac brands so i just picked up that and then i got a light so i'm gonna do that this morning and hope for the best because my nails are honestly like paper right now it's horrible um and hopefully this will make them nice and strong okay so i've just done the first hand fully expecting like you know when you do gel nails like shellac polish and then at the end you have to wipe off the sticky stuff like fully holding my breath like is this gonna wipe off all my nail polish but it's worked so this is the color i always wear this finger here um, my nail literally snapped as i was doing um the filing so that's really annoying because it's very short now but yeah i'm pretty impressed with that not bad for a first attempt so yeah i'm gonna crack on and do the other hand that will be the hardest bit because i have to use my left hand to do it but um I am very impressed with myself if I say so. I didn't know something was wrong. Here I was dreaming we got along so perfectly. morning um so today's been a very lazy start to the day um i went to bed really early last night i had pizza which was so good and then woke up this morning and just took it very slowly i thought i'd show you this little top actually it's from top shop i think it's really cute for spring summer um is the brightness up yeah um and then i have these h&m jeans on and i'm trying to shoot some content but wait let me turn you around I'm trying to shoot content in my house 
but I am finding it so <laughs> difficult like I'm not the kind of person that's like looks at an area of the house and thinks oh, that would look so good in a picture like I'm just not creative like that um so I feel like I've kind of exhausted all my options I do mirror pictures in this room and then I do I did some in the bedroom the other day but I'm just kind of like where am I supposed to shoot I don't know where to shoot <laughs> first world problems I know um but yeah I got up did my makeup properly today which looks nice it's nice to actually wear it again you Johnny. Um, my skin is still very, very dry though. Can you see all around here? It's all crusty. This is healing up nicely. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd check in because I, I would have seen all of the signs of our fault. I'm sorry, but we are something real. Bit of you, bit of me. morning guys um so it's now sunday um yeah i'm gonna try and put this vlog up tonight so i'm gonna try and film quite a lot today it's a very very chill day as every day is right now um but i'm gonna just do some like housey bits and maybe some fitness um but look at my face <laughs> so i obviously showed you guys at the start of this vlog how i scratched it in my sleep um and then i was wearing gloves to bed um the last few nights and Last night, well actually my scabs had like basically healed, like my face was almost back to normal and then I woke up this morning and I scratched it again and you can kind of see here and there's also a scratch up here. Um, like look at that, <laughs> it's so bad. So I've ordered some gloves from Amazon which are cotton and like are strap, like kind of velcro around the wrist so hopefully I won't pull them off or they won't fall off in bed um, because yeah that is pretty bad. Which is so annoying, but um, yeah, I just need to like stop scratching myself. I don't understand how I'm not waking up because like they're pretty bad scratches, um, and I wake up and there's like blood. Un it has to be uncomfortable. And um, there's like blood underneath my nails, so I don't know how I'm not waking up from like pain. <clears throat> but Johnny said the other night he caught me doing it in my sleep and had to wake me up to stop me from scratching. So I don't understand though because my face isn't itchy. Like I'd I'm not finding it itchy day to day. But obviously I'm finding itchy at night. Anyway, um, yeah, as I said, it's Sunday. So housey bits are going to get done today. I want to take down all the rubbish and all the cardboard from up here. I want to change the bed sheets. And um, then I actually want to watch some Netflix, you know. I want to have a really chilled day. I also just got a delivery through from Press Juice, which is the juicing company I use whenever I juice. Um, well, mostly the one I use. So they very kindly sent us some juices and some soups. I'll show you that in a minute and yeah not much else to report i faked hand last night actually um i used this ultra dark from coco brown i love this tan this or tan lux is what i use this is a very sunday outfit um i have a crop cropped jumper on from misguided i have a little um vest top on from topshop and then i have these cotton leggings on from topshop and then my emu slippers which i love um but also, actually, I would recommend maybe not getting black because I... Let me check. Hold on. Yeah, they're kind of staining my feet black, like, ever so slightly. Not too much, but um, the other two colours definitely don't do that. So keep that in mind. Okay, so this is what I got from Press London. I've used their services for so, so long. And then just recently, I bought another cleanse that was from Prescription to try that. Both were lovely, but they very kindly gifted me this. I think it's called the Immunity Boosting Pack. So you get some juices, so green juices, and then also like this one, which actually looks really nice. I think orange, lemon, turmeric, cay cayenne pepper, grapefruit, and tangerine. Um, and then also some of their soups, which I've had in cleansers before, and they're so, so yummy. It's super easy. You just put them in the fridge and then put them on the hob when you want to eat them, obviously. Um, and they're so filling. So yeah, really nice little package. That was so kind of them. You want to come take a juice, Johnny? Like an easy green? Or a daily celery. I think easy green. <coughs> or, no, you can't have that one. Apple, lemon, romaine, cucumber, kale, spinach. Actually, you're only allowed that because the rest of them only have one of them. <laughs> oh, no, it's your face. Yeah, I know. Jesus Christ. I've already told them about it. It's so much worse it's than worse the last It's worse than the camera. No, it looks worse than the Why first. can't I have this super glow? Because there's only one of them. And or I a sweet them. citrus? You can have that one. What's that nut? Orange, lemon, turmeric, cayenne. Oh, that sounds good. Yeah. That's an immune booster for sure. Turmeric, cayenne. 
How are you finding isolation? It's good. It's be productive, guys. Be productive. We've never spent so much time together, have we? Ever. <laughs> <laughs> later now um i didn't film too much because i ended up just getting like really into the mood of cleaning which actually feels so nice to have a clean house again um yeah anyway i've just been editing this vlog back and it is very low beat like i feel like my energy is so low throughout it um so yeah sorry about that sorry if it's been a little bit boring but um i'm gonna keep vlogging so you'll have probably very a very similar vlog next week hopefully just me being a little bit more upbeat but i hope you guys are all well i hope you enjoyed the vlog i'm gonna sign off now because there's not really much else happening um i'm gonna just cook dinner and watch netflix actually what's this documentary called um tiger king let me know if you've watched it i feel like everybody's talking about it right now um and i have watched the trailer and i'm like this actually looks terrible but everyone is obsessed with it so i'm gonna give it a go tonight um and yeah, I think that's all I have to really say. I promise you in the next vlog, I'm going to do my tanning routine. So um, that will be out in a few days, but I promise I'm gonna do it. I was gonna do it today, but I think this is kind of dragged on quite a lot and there's not actually that much good stuff in this vlog. So um, I'll do it in the next one. But yeah, thank you for watching. Um, everything will be linked down below. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.